Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review and a demo on the new Anastasia Brow Definer. Um, this has been out for a little bit now so I thought I'd go ahead and show you what it um, looks like on my brows. Right now I don't have anything on my eyebrows at all so I'll go ahead and zoom you in and we'll go ahead and get started with the demo. So here we go. Sorry to be so close up and personal in your face. But we will go ahead and get started. As you can see, my eyebrows are not the, like super, super sparse, but I do have, you know, I want to make them thicker. So this product does definitely help with that. So I'm going to take the pointier end of it and start going along the bottom. And make a tail here. So I get the shape I want underneath without going down too far. And then I go on the top where the arch is. And then bring it down. And then go ahead and fill in the top part. And then what I like to do is just kind of angle up right here. And make a little mark. And then just lightly... brush up the front part of it here just a little bit and then just come it over like that putting a little more pressure on the end and as you can see that quick how much of a difference it made from this eyebrow it's not over the top it's nothing you know over like crazy or anything like that, like overdefined or overfilled in. Like I think sometimes those um, pomades can really make your eyebrows look like really drawn on, but this looks pretty natural, and it looks um, looks like it's just a natural brow. So just a little bit thicker, and I really do like it. So let's go ahead and do the other eyebrow. So we have an even one here. Just go ahead and spool them out first, and do again like before start off with the pointier side and just draw underneath making short little strokes and getting a little bit more pressure as you get to the tail and then um, go ahead and go on top and fill in and go ahead and make the arch I find that this makes making the arch a lot easier than the brow is. It's just the way it's shaped. Something about the way it's shaped. Okay, so that's looking pretty even with the other one. And then go ahead and make our little mark. And just square it off using a very light hand right here. And going up, brushing up. Just making sure that it is the same as the other side. And then just spooling through as you go. And that's pretty pretty even there. So that's what it looks like. I'll go ahead and zoom out now. So that's what they look like um, done, both of them done. And um, I just really like the ease and the application of this one better than the Brow Wiz. The Brow Wiz, I, I still like that pencil, um, but it does take a lot longer because it is so tiny and precise that, and pinpointed that you have to really, you know, take your time. With this, if you're wanting more of a thicker, bolder brow, it doesn't take as long at all to get that um, result that you're looking for so and this one retails for $23 and you're getting a little bit more product in it um, this is 0.007 ounces and then the brow whiz is 0.003 ounces so you're getting a little bit more product but you are paying a couple more dollars so um, overall I give this product a thumbs up I really enjoy it I think there's a little bit of a learning curve too when I first got it. I wasn't sure like how to 
lay the pencil down. I wanted, I didn't know if I should use the fatter end, you know, on, on certain spots, but I think if you use the, the more the pointier tip underneath and up here and then take the fatter side and go, you know, up like that to fill in the front part of it, it makes it a lot easier. So I really do love this product and I'm glad that I picked it up. So if um, you've tried it or you have any questions about it, please feel free to leave them in the con comments. I can't even speak. Comments below. And um, if you enjoyed this video, just give it a thumbs up. And thank you so much for watching. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye, guys.